Why, look. It's the bastard son of the late William Kidd. Still a mere boy, and yet... Ten times the demon his father was. Fancy seeing you here, can we? Still looking sleek and mean. Did you steal that costume from a dandy in Havana? No, sir. I found this on a corpse. One that was walking about and talking shite to my face only moments before. Huh. So, what's this I hear about a planned raid on a plantation? Not keeping secrets from me, are you? Not very well. Every day, schooners packed with sugar sail past, coming from plantations nearby. Most times, they stop here, sell off a few crates. There's one man visiting today that had earned you a fine profit. So if you'd like to rob his plantation, I'll point him out. I would. Is it a Mr. Beckford that owns this plantation? That's the man. He owns dozens round these islands. And he's bloody rich. Just the sort I like to see robbed. His agent is around here somewhere. Find and follow him. And he'll lead you straight to your prize. <laughs> Party molasses and raw cane, that's a given. It gladdens me to hear your saying so. But despite the waywardness of your enterprise here, I understand that you are men of discernment. But Manning, to me. We've done with this place. Aye, sir. What's our course? We'll return to the plantation and there take stock of our inventory. It's a good harvest. You might not talk so loud, sir. But this isn't anything like a friendly place. No, man. I had a delightful conversation with you. We came to quite a bit of All up and done well, boys. We're going home. of a man crafting a bold idea. Look, I've seen before. You mark well, Anne. I've just overheard one of the Beckford's men talking grandly about his plantation and all the cargo he's keeping there. And it gave me the idea that I might take these goods off him and sell them off for a better price than he'd ever ask. <laughs> ah, a man of vision. I like this idea. Hold on, there's trouble of fall. I see them.
Let's have a song then. Oh, Billy Riley, where's a dancing master? Oh, Billy Riley. Bob, I'm bully in the alley. Way, bully in the alley. Bob, I'm bully in the alley. Bully dancing for now. Sally, girl that I love dearly. Way, bully in the alley. I think we've lost them, sir. Ship coming after us, sir! Cutter! Cutters are English! Seems to be alone, sir! All right, Jack, sing! Hey, boys! Oh, as I was hey. going to talk, we'll heave him up and away we'll go! Way to Tiana! We'll heave him up and away we'll go! We'll all go to the west old ship that ever did sail! This man's working for Peter Bagford's people. Do you know them? The Bagfords and their sugar empire. Aye. The Bagfords and the Draxes. I never worked their plantations, but I knew their names from hearing other men curse them. But you worked a plantation, no? A modest one, aye. As a striker in the boiling house. Boiling house? Was it water they boiled? Something else? Cane juices. The hard process making sugar. Dangerous. Must be why it fetches such a dear price. What's it like? Toiling on a plantation day and night. Well, with the cane sugar cut and harvested, it's run between two metal rollers across the juice from the plant. After collecting the juice, it was time to boil away the waters from the sugar. This we did in tatches made of copper. But let me tell you, brother, boiling sugar is near the hottest thing on earth. Just a touch on the skin will stick like bird lime and burn on, leaving a terrible scar. Jesus. It's a risk to anchor too close. The soldiers roving the plantation would catch us for sure. Drop here then and sneak ashore. We'll look after the jackdaw. such disarray. Bit of a do, sir, that's all. It's Wilmington's birthday. And you saw fit to get pickled on duty. No bother, sir. We've got everything sorted. We'll soon see, won't we? For you must double the watch this evening. Double, sir? Whatever for? I believe I was followed by pirates in my eyes on me. Though the ship was uncommonly large for such rascals. Certainly wasn't slavers, though. Not a ship that size. In any case, double the watch. And keep your damned eyes wide for anything suspicious. You up there! Look alive, man! You've a job to do! Apologies, sir. I'll keep my eyes peeled. What the hell is going on here today? How do you suppose you'll be able to ring that alarm if you're pissed drunk? Come back here! For God's sake, what the hell is going on here today? How do you suppose you'll be able to ring that alarm if you're pissed drunk and barely able to stand? Forgive me, sir. I am fit and able. If I see any strangeness about... You'll hear the bell ringing straight away, I promise. Ah, 
I'd like to speak to the man in charge here. I require entrance to the warehouse. Which of you dogs has the key to the warehouse, huh? The ladies, we don't leave. The key, goddammit. Someone find me the key. No one's over here. Take me the warehouse, see if you please. Stop there. Alarm! Rouse yourselves, you dullards! Clear shot on him. Oh, shit! Alarm! Alarm! You get back here. Stop it! Get out of this! Shit! <sighs>